Some Launcher is an application for Windows and Mac created to automate the process of downloading and updating overgrowth, as well as make it easier to edit your settings and getting custom content. SUM stands for Settings, Updates and Mods. It also has a self-updater to ensure that you always have the latest version of the application. SUM Launcher has its own thread in the secret pre-order form from where you can download it. To get there, just follow the link in the description. If you're not already logged in, it'll ask you for your forum username and password, and once you're in the thread, you can find the download links right here at the top. If you don't have permission to view this part of the forum, that's probably because you haven't registered your copy of Overgrowth with your forum account. Click this annotation or check the description of the video to get to a tutorial about how to fix that. Once the file is downloaded, open it up and you'll see this file. If you're on Mac, drag the file to your Applications folder, and if you're on Windows, you can put it anywhere on your computer. The first time you run the program, it will ask you for your secret pre-order forum key. You can find this key if you open up the email you got from contact at wolffire.com when you pre-ordered Overgrowth, and uh, click the link to your pre-order panel. And that pre-order panel should look something like this. And here's the key that we're looking for. We only need the eight last characters there though, so mark them, right click, copy, go back to the application, hold control and press V to paste them, and then just hit OK. And some launcher will remember your key, so you won't have to type it in every time you launch the application. If there is a newer version of some launcher available, it will ask you if you would like to install it. If you want that, just uh, press yes and uh, let it update. If there's a more recent alpha version available than the one you have installed, some launcher will ask you if you'd like to update. Press the update alpha button and it'll do that for you. It can update several alphas at once, so even if you're a few alphas behind, you can still use some launcher to update. Once it has finished all updating, this is the window that you'll see. The first button will close down the launcher and start overgrowth. The second button will bring up a new window where you can download over 60 user-created levels as well as keep them up to date with just the press of this button there. It also adds a few official levels and some more items to your object browser. The edit config button can be used to uh, change all the settings in the game very easily. And then we have the menu at the top. Under File, you can let some launcher automatically install, reinstall, or re-update Overgrowth, as well as have it delete various local files for you. If you download and install Overgrowth here, you can resume and interrupt the download by selecting the same file name and path that the interrupted download had. This is very useful if you, for instance, lose your internet connection during the download. Under Edit Preferences, you can tell it if you want it to update several alphas at once if needed, and you can tell it where your Overgrowth installation is located. If you're on Mac, you'll have two more options in here as well. One to enable the debug console, which is off by default on Mac, and one to have some launcher automatically rename the overgrowth executable file when you update. And under the links and help menus, you have a bunch of useful shortcuts. And that's about it. A big thank you to the Sum OG Utilities team for creating this amazing program. My name is Silverfish, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a great day.